Welcome to Noble Things of Wisdom with Pastor Bimbo Akinjoku. Be blessed as you listen. Good morning, my dear friends. Will a man drink poison simply because he's so thirsty and cannot get water to drink? The answer is no. The pressures of life are real but there cannot be enough excuses for any man to live a sinful life. I understand what you are going through. I know that the challenges in front of you are quite enormous and they look as if they are going to drown you. I understand that you are in a place of great desperation and it looks as if there is no help coming from anywhere for you. Different thoughts may be going through your mind. Why not embrace prostitution? Why not begin armed robbery? Why not try defrauding people? Why not start selling fake and expired drugs so that you can make quick money? Yes, you have need for money. Yes, you are in a desperate situation. But that can never be good enough excuse for you to engage in any of these evil practices. I know that the devil will always try to make it look as if there is no help coming for you from anywhere. But that is a lie. He always tries to block your reasoning so that you will not even see the provision that God has made for you. Do you remember the story of Hagar? She thought that she was going to die of thirst. She had even abandoned her son, thinking that the son too was going to die of thirst. But God opened her eyes and she saw a well of water that was lying very close to her. Notice, the well of water did not just appear. God opened her eyes and she saw the well of water. The well of water had been there all along, but she had been so blinded by her need that she had not seen it. I'm telling you today that God has not left you helpless. Just like the well of water was near Hagar, the solution to your problem is somewhere near you. If you would turn to God today, He will open your eyes to see it. But if you will focus on your problems and listen to the whispers of the enemy, He will always lead you into a place of destruction. Please, don't drink this cup of poison. Turn to God and He will show you where your cup of water is. It is my prayer for you that you will find the help of God as you go into this week and you will prosper in all that you do. God bless you and have a fruitful week. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You have just listened to Noble Things of Wisdom with Pastor Bimbo Akijoko. This conversation continues on Facebook and Twitter. Simply like Bimbo R. Akijoko on Facebook or follow at Bimbo Akijoko on Twitter. For questions and comments, please call 0809-533-8612 or 0805-901-0005. Remember to tune in next time. God bless you. This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Hill City Inspiration House.